Hey guys, before we begin, hit the subscribe button for new celebrity updates every single day. All right, so in this week's episode of The Kardashians, Courtney is not happy with Hulu producers for how they edited and put together episode four of this season, where she and Travis Barker got engaged and have their engagement party. During this episode, we see tons of Scott Disick drama where the family and sisters are worried about how Scott Disick will react to Courtney's engagement and to the fact that Scott Disick didn't know they were getting engaged and obviously wasn't invited to the fancy and exciting family event. I know when I was watching this episode, I also was wondering why everyone put such a focus on Scott's feelings when he had 10 long years to treat Courtney the way she begged him to treat her and to work on his substance abuse issues and cheating problems. All throughout the years of keeping up with the Kardashians, we see Courtney beg Scott to change his ways and yet he never does. However, Scott Disick always paints himself to be the victim by acting sad that Courtney won't take him back or won't marry him, and he even tries to get all of Courtney's sisters and mom on his side. I was always shocked to see Kris Jenner, Courtney's mom, seem to always side with Scott, even though in the first few seasons of Keeping Up, we see Kris Jenner and Khloe Kardashian so against Scott. I always wondered what exactly changed. However, now Scott Disick has become so important to the Kardashians as he and Courtney have three kids together and he has just been in their lives for so long. But while viewers thought Kim, Courtney, Kylie, and Kendall spent Courtney's engagement night hyper focused on Scott, Courtney now wants to set the record straight, saying that it was only a few minutes out of the night spent talking about Scott, not 50% of the night like the Hulu editors made it out to be. Courtney is seen telling her close friend Steph Shep that she's angry because the episode should have been happy and empowering to see Courtney get out of a toxic relationship and into a healthy and beautiful engagement with Travis Barker. Courtney says it's enough because for years her toxic relationship with Scott Disick was at the forefront of her family show, and so she believes the producers just wanted to continue with that storyline and paint her as the moody sister with a difficult love life. However, Court's friend, Steph, comes to the rescue and says something like, this just isn't reality. That storyline doesn't exist anymore. You're happy now and you got your happy ending. However, Steph also points out that she understands why producers of the show focused on Scott and his feelings in this episode because Steph says that if she were a viewer, she too would be wondering how Scott reacts to Courtney and Travis Barker getting engaged. In my opinion, Courtney gave Scott so many years of her life and now she's moved on and happy with Scott. And Scott also has had at least two public relationships since being with Courtney, including dating Sophia Ritchie, who was also seen in previous seasons of The Kardashians. Also, we see Kendall Jenner question Courtney, asking if she has any empathy for Scott at all. And Courtney says, yes, she does have empathy. I think it would be nice for Courtney to have empathy for Scott, but to be honest, Courtney deserves to focus on herself, her now fiance, and her kids. What do you guys think about all this? Do you agree with Courtney or Kendall? And what are your thoughts about Scott? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching, subscribe right now, and see you in my next video.